Hi everyone. We have a number of tools to track and to manage and control um, our process day to day. Now beyond our daily visual management board, I'm a really big advocate of hour by hour boards or hour by hour trackers. Now the board behind me is um, I think quite a good example. So we've got each hour of the day, we've got the performance target for each hour. Um, they have a, a cumulative figure to know where they're at for the day and they have an actual output and we have a red or green, so hit or miss. So what we expect to happen and what actually happened. Um, now, what I'd expect to see typically as on this board is where we have a miss. There's some commentary around that. Um, yes, I'd like to see it when it's green as well, but certainly um, as a rule, uh, definitely when we have a miss, there should be some reasons and understanding and perhaps some action there. Um, Another part of the hour by hour process, again, is to break down our day to day activity into small steps. Because what I've seen in the past is you can drift pretty quickly and then we get to the end of the day and we go, oh my God, you know, what happened? We, you know, we missed by a mile. This way we're keeping the intensity, we're keeping the focus right and we're escalating problems quickly. So generally for, uh, as a rule for me, where we have two hours that miss in a row, that's an immediate escalation to the production manager or the production leader, and then we're talking about that. So we're escalating, supporting very quickly. Um, the other thing with this is it's management at a glance. So it's very simple, very easy to see what's going on, and it will stimulate the appropriate questions and the appropriate conversations if we need. So again, it's a pretty brief overview, but that's a, a, an hour by hour board example. In this process, we have one for every work center as well as the, the daily board, um, and that's driven and continues to drive um, a lot of improvement. Thanks for your time.